Hello, Carlita. Good evening. How are you tonight? Everything good. <laughs> I'm glad to hear that. It's Friday. Oh, yes. You have any plans? Oh, no. no, it's sleeping. Sorry? <laughs> it's sleeping. Sleeping, that's a good plan. I love that plan. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> that's an amazing plan. And I, and I envy you. Uh, what time are you planning to wake up tomorrow? Mm -hmm. uh, tomorrow um i i will uh, i will wake up to six At? at six o'clock i am and next i work with my pet And because she all day, she wants to outside to work. She wants to go outside I for she a wants walk. to go outside for a walk. For a walk. She Yes. wants to go for a walk. She wants to go for a walk. That sounds better. Yes. Next. So, wait, do you have a dog? Yes, I have a lot. Hmm. She is tummy. Her name is Ta Ta Tammy with a T. Yes, um, um, And you yes, also and you also have your cat, right? yes, I have to cut. Hmm. And next, I I will going to work. On Saturday tomorrow. Yes, because on weekend I work with. with my own business. I work at my own business, my aunt aunt business. Really? Okay. Yes. Tomorrow tomorrow I have planning to put the Christmas decoration. Tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah, me do you know what? Um yeah. My wife and I are going to be um by ourselves we're going to be alone for the weekend in fact she's she's just going to Lourdes right now to leave the kids with my parents-in-law but we don't find something to do and we don't want to spend money so I, I'm planning to to tell her that we should decorate the house just to give a surprise for the kids you know whenever they come back they can find the house arranged For Christmas. What do you think? Yes. yes, I like the Christmas. I, I am crazy by Christmas because I want to put for all house many light color light. Many And light colors? You like wait, you yes. like light light colors. Okay. Yes. Uh, but but tomorrow I decorate the, the I will decorate the shops, the ice cream shops. Wait, The the I family okay, the family business is a ice cream shop. Oh, I got you. You will decorate the shops. Yes, I will do. And What's Sunday, the name? What's the name of the shops? El Sin Rival. What? Are you kidding me? That's awesome. Are you from Santa Ana? No. 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 Okay, I'm No. lost. I'm lost. Where are the Sin Rival original from? Yes, this is the Santa Ana. But Okay. in my case, I only have a Um, how do you say a uh, franchise? A franchise. Franchise, yes. Really? Oh, okay. So the family business is franchising Sin Rival. I thought you were the owners, like, <laughs> oh my I God, know. I was like, wow, in shock. <laughs>
It's amazing. I would like. I wish, uh, I wish. Yes, but no. Okay. Yes. That's good. How it long is, how long have you had this uh, shops this these branches? Mm -hmm. Since um, two thousand, uh, I start in two thousand seventeen. We started on 2017. 2017. We started on 2017. Wow. Mm -hmm. so that, that's been five years. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah. That's a long time. Great. Congratulations. Where's everybody else? Okay. We are five, six, right? Yeah, we're six. Give me just a minute. Do you live in, in Santana, Santana, teacher? No, I, I live in. No. I live in San Salvador, near to Motocross, Calle Motocross. Um, uh -huh. mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm from Santa Ana. I mean, I was born in Santa Ana. I was raised in Santa Ana. But I moved, I moved to San Salvador in 1998. Oh. 1998. It's, it's been, oh my God. <laughs> Four days ago. Four yeah. days ago in 1998, I moved to San Salvador. I had I, I made a tattoo on my leg and I moved to San Salvador in on the, November 14th, 1998. Uh, 43 years? Okay. Come on, it's not 43 years, it's just 24. <laughs> I 24. got 40, 24 years ago. <laughs> oh my god, I'm old. Yeah. I know. Good evening. Yeah, dice la Oh my God, Carla, no. If you are old, what about me? <laughs> but yeah, we look young. Thanks. <laughs> Adita, how do you feel? Do you feel old or young? In your teacher. <laughs> I feel young. No. I feel it. young. How wait, many wait, wait. Do you have? Uh, 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 do the right no, no, question. How, how old are you? I'm sorry. Excellent. How old are you? I'm 40. Ah, are you young? I, I'm about <laughs> to, I'm about to turn 41. Uh, Patricia, how do you feel? Do you feel young or old? Uh, young. Right. You know what? I feel young, but sometimes I feel old. When, when I, when I walk, when I walk long distances and my hip gets locked, no se me traba la cadera. Mm -hmm. I go like, wait, what? <laughs> How do you so say no parece, Tisha? Uh huh. How do you say no parece? Mm -hmm. No parece edad, de la edad. Yeah, no parece de tu edad. <laughs> in English. <laughs> of course, in English. Okay, you say uh, you don't look like. For example, you don't look like 40. You don't look like 40. Mm -hmm. You look like, listen, you look like in your 30s, maybe. I know. But you know what? My father has been here since yesterday. He came really late at night. And, and we spent the day together with my other brother, who is, my youngest brother is, nine years no he's 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 10 10 years old my youngest brother and the thing is that i realize i will look exactly like my father i got we actually measured bellies we measured bellies without our shirts we were like who has the biggest belly who has the biggest belly <laughs> we look alike oh my god anyways Okay, guys, let me do the attendance. It's nine, I'm sorry, 8, 12 already. And we are nine, so let's give it a, a shot. Let's give it a shot with nine people. 
help me encouraging. Oh, when is coming? Yeah. Oh, we're nine still. Encourage your classmates, guys, to don't miss the last classes. This is after this one, we will be missing three classes. This is our class number 22. We just three classes and it's over. And Merry Christmas to you, oh my God. Oh no, wait, uh, happy Thanksgiving, right? In case you celebrate that, I cannot find your list. Oh my God. Yeah, this is it. Oh my God, where are you guys? Oh, there we are. Okay, let's do the attendance really quick so we can start the class having a small conversation using the grammar we've learned so far. So, Ada Patricia Linares Galdames. Present. Adriana Stephanie Martinez Flores. Adri is not here yet. Ana Sermi Chévez. No. Edwin Alexander Ayala Erazo. No. Gabriela Alejandra González Flores. Present. Thank you. Gloria Elizabeth Linares Galdames. Here. Thank you. Carla Verónica Vázquez de Rivas. Present. Excellent. Kenia Michelle Lara Sayas. Not yet. Nelson Edgardo Sánchez Ramírez. Nelson. Okay, Nelson is there, but not here. Okay. Pamela Beatriz Posada Reina. She's having problems with her audio and camera. Roselena Salgado de Serrano. Thank you. Sandra Gladys Méndez Ramírez. Susana Carolina Hernández Iraeta. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present. Good evening. Good evening, Walter. Thank you. Wendy Patricia Molina Duarte. She's connecting. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. What's up? Welcome. Present. Nelson. Okay, there we go. So let's start. Nelson present teacher. Hi, right, thank you. Thank you, Nelson. Yeah, I got you. I got you. Give me just a minute. I'm just gonna. Who is this person? Give me just a minute, guys. I'm sorry. Oh, okay. Sanders in another meeting. Okay. Uh -huh. So I need to mention Pamela and Wendy. Oh, there's Wendy. Hi, Wendy. Hi, teacher. Welcome. Thank Wendy, quería preguntarle. Ahorita tenía algún problema para, o se tardó Zoom para reconocerle el micrófono y la cámara. Sí, teacher. Pero no sé, es porque no tengo Wi-Fi. Entonces yo creí que era por, por mis datos. Ok. Ok, algo así le debe estar ocurriendo a Pamela. A veces, bien frecuentemente le ocurre eso. Ok, just wondering. So, thank you. Thank you. Tonight. Ok. Nice topic is on page 30 of your workbook. So, what we're going to do right now is just start um, with an activity in group going to page 30. Give me just a minute. Let me retrieve that and start a presentation, let's say, or just show you this. There we go, there we go. Okay, so this is it, it's page 30 on page, I'm sorry, 29, page 29. We have an exercise about yesterday's topic. So during the first hour, the plan is to 
study this a little bit, okay? See if there are any gaps still in your knowledge about this topic. That's the first stage. So read this briefly, you know, understand, forget plus gerund, forget plus an infinitive. And then just with your classmate, because you're gonna be on couples, we're very little people. So <clears throat> and practice answering or completing the blanks, filling the blanks. So it says try, organize. The manager, mm, a meeting last week, okay? So remember what we started yesterday? Look at the examples. So we have try, try plus a gerund, try plus an infinitive. Okay, what, what's the meaning of each one? So based on that, just answer these six exercises on page 29. Questions? Teacher, I don't have the book. Really? Shall, shall I send the images to, to the WhatsApp? Yes, please. Okay. Come on, guys. Wake up. It's Friday and the body knows it. Hold on. Let me send the rules and I'll send the exercise right away. Okay, there's the first page, first section, and I'm gonna send you the second section right away. There we go. Okay, now let me split the class. Si le voy a rogar que por favor todos se unan a los grupos, porque van a ser grupos muy pequeños y muy probablemente alguien se va a quedar sin pareja. So, eh, ahorita los arreglo. Let's see, we are... 10, so let's try couples. What do you think? No, 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 let's try trios instead. And yeah, there will be one group with four people and two groups with trios, hoping that everybody connects, okay? So let's do the exercises for this. You will have no more than 25 minutes. Let's start, let's go. You can share your screen if you want. Oh, Uy. ok, Wendy, si me escucha, porfa, acepte la invitación, Wilfredo, porfa, si puedes aceptar la invitación, Let me see. Ah, okay, here. Ah, okay. Um, picture two. Um, yeah. Complete sentence using the best. Yes. Yes. Yes, number six. Okay,
Yes, Carlita. Okay, okay. Complete I... the sentences. Yes. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. Number one. Okay. Number one, I think uh, organizing, try organizing. Okay. Try organizing. Okay, but, but do you look think... at the look at the examples above? Yes, please. Yeah, yes. because try try plus your own or try plus infinitive. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So okay. try to organize or try organizing. Mm -hmm. That's good. Try organizing. The manager tried organizing. Mirror mm -hmm. and Try to organizing. Infinity. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Try organizing. Why not? Yeah. Okay. Try. Yeah. What? In two or next to war. Uh, mm -hmm. I don't feel uh, good and right now uh, so it is more or less mm -hmm. and you Gabriela um, I started with uh, fever fever yeah, fever. Mm -hmm. uh, signs uh, last Saturday. And I made the test on uh, Monday. Mm -hmm. But um, I feel better now. Just, just have a flu and pain in the body. <laughs> But mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you have coke, coke is tos, coke, coke. Yes. Yeah. Uh, right now, uh, no. <laughs> but at the beginning, yes. <laughs> mm. But you have a a, a vaccine. Uh, sorry. You have a vaccine. Is vacunas. Uh, yes, I I only have two. Uh, well, I I wish you feel better. <laughs> Thank you. I I ladies. Hello. I Hello. Am, I'm late. What is it? Hi. What is the activity? Uh, we must we complete exercise six mm -hmm, in okay. the page twenty nine. Okay. Okay. I see. Hi. Writing okay, and the first one I think is the manager try to organize a meeting last week. Try to. 
I'm sorry, ladies. Try Yeah, the manager tried to. Somebody evoke me? Teacher. We are in trouble. We are in trouble. <laughs> Why? Yeah, I, I don't know if I'm, I'm, I'm confused. We need to use the two verbs in the uh, between parentheses. Yes? Mm -hmm. ah, okay. <clears throat> okay. Okay. I'm not too lost. <laughs> <laughs> Just look at the examples. For example, if the last example is about try plus a gerund or try plus an infinitive. Now, I ask you, what is the um, grammar tense the on the first sentence? It's the past. So, yeah, because it, does, it says last week, right? We need to use try in the past. Exactly. Okay, the, the manager tried, tried to organize. I don't know, you tell me. <laughs> no, yeah, but try in the past. Okay. Yeah, try must be in the past. But are okay. you going to say to organize or organizing? Read, look at the example and find sense. <clears throat> the manager? They even give you a clue at the end to attempt. So let's see, the first one says try plus a gerund. This form is used when something is done as an experiment, but the result may not be successful. And you have try plus an infinitive. It means to means it means to attempt something to make an effort. Mm. Okay, so just read the examples. I'm gonna be here if you need me, okay? I'll be here. Uh -huh, okay, continue, continue, continue. The manager, um, repeat again, the manager. Right. Right. Are you viendo this expression? Yes, it's raining here. O sea que la número uno sería the manager try organizing, organizing a meeting last week. No. Organizing or organize. For me, for me, I don't know. I, I, I was a confused. The manager tried to organize a meeting last week for me, for me. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> the manager tried to organize. Try plus girl. Try ah, okay. plus oh. infinity. And the when manager, the, I can say the manager. Oh my God. And when the pass, know. and when the pass is uh, uh, the using E and H. For example, he was talking of the phone and he is stopping writing another post. No. The second. The second, he was talking on the phone and he stopped to writing. I know. He and I can't, I don't know. Um, he stopped writing a note on a post and he stopped. Writing a note on a post. Stop writing. O sea que en ese en español allí no cambiaríamos nada. Yes. Write for writing. Writing, right? Yeah. Ah, okay. 
he was talking on the phone and he stopped and and he stopped writing. Writing, writing. No, right. on a post-it. Mm -hmm. He stopped. He stopped writing. Let me let me read again because I'm so confused. I don't know why. Okay. These verbs can be followed by either the gerund or the infinitive with a change in meaning. Forget, remember, stop, and try. Forget plus gerund. It means to forget something. Okay, forget plus infinity. Forget to meet. Um, try. I will try to contact the manager. For me, is the manager try? Mm -hmm. Okay, the manager try try. Organizing a meeting last week. Organizing this meeting. Last yeah, week. the manager tried to organizing because try plus the gerund meaning that what something is done but not be set successful. The manager tried organ. Tried organizing. Try. Try organizing. Try, try. try. organizing. Organizing, yes, but try, try the, try. 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 Because he's stuck in the past last week. Yet, the employees will never forget preparing a dinner for those affected by the earthquake. Number four, forget preparing. Los empleados nunca olvidarán Number four. Number five. Number four, forget repairing. Repairing? Repairing, because don't forget something that happened in the past. Repairing. 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 Number five. Repairing. Repairing. Number five. Bigger company. Bigger company. To try hard smaller companies to increase their profits and experiment. Try. It is the Gerald. Bigger companies should try helping smaller companies to increase their own profits. Helping? Try helping. Try helping. Try yeah. helping. Experiment. In number six, forget the six. Don't care on time to receive your hour. Don't forget to perform activity. Don't forget 
to be. Forget to be, yeah. Forget to be. So forget to be. To be their their own tie, preside. And in three, this um, ah, include, dijimos, include, including. Remember to include. To include. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Con ING o, o include. Así no, como infinitive, está. Sandrita. Infinitive, to okay. include. To include. That's right, teacher. Sorry, what number are you working on? <laughs> number three. <laughs> number three, okay. The action is to perform an activity. So... And the verb is remember. So let's see. Um, that will be in infinitive. Yes, remember to include. To remember to perform a responsibility task. So yeah, remember to include your names include. in the application forms. Yeah. Okay, that's number three. Thank you, teacher. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I'm studying something you, you, else. You look serious, teacher. I, I, yeah, it's just that I was reading the next activity that we're going okay. to do after this one. <laughs> and I'm, I'm surprised that many of you are, are having some some difficulty, you know, doing this exercise. I'm like, well, okay, so we have to work on that. Don't worry. Keep going. You're missing three, right? Okay. Call me if you need me. Thank you, teacher. Yes, we complete a teacher. Wait, you, you finished? Yeah. Okay, allow me just a minute. Let me check the other two groups. Thank you. Okay, so we are done, right? Okay. Yes, teacher. Good, I'm just checking. We're almost done. Increase the all profits. Bigger companies? Uh huh. Should try helping. Mm -hmm. We'll try helping. An experiment. Um, An experiment. Bigger companies should, should try helping a smaller companies to increase their, their own profits. And the number six, don't mm -hmm. forget be there on time to receive your award. Don't forget to perform activity. Forget. Okay. Don't forget being there on time to receive to receive your award. Don't forget being there on time to receive your award. Don't forget, oh yeah, don't forget, don't forget being, being there. Tem, 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 tem. 
Okay. Okay, so let's see. I think we're back. We're all back. So let's see. So what do you think about number one, the manager? Let me go with Gabriela, number one. Okay. Um, the manager tried to organize a meeting last week. Okay. Try to, try to organize, try to organize. The manager try to organize, try to organize or try to try to try to try to organize. And that's the past try to try to. OK, yeah, I agree with you. What do you think, guys? Why is that the answer? Because try plus an infinitive means to attempt something to make an effort. OK, to give it a try if you use Stripe with an infinitive. Number two, Nelson Edgardo Sanchez Ramirez. Present teacher. Teacher, <laughs> Nelson have a problem with the electricity. With the electricity, okay. Yeah. Okay. Carlita, was, can you oh, wait, wait? Go ahead, Nelson. Yeah. Oh. He was talking on the phone and he stopped to write a, a note on a positive interaction. Stop to write. Stop. Stop to write. Let's see. It means to win an action. Okay. Stop plus an infinity and means to interrupt an action to start a new one. Hmm. He was talking on the phone and he stopped writing a note on a post-it. He was talking on the phone and he stopped to write a note on a post-it. I agree with you, Nelson. What do you think, guys? I agree. Yeah, so we all agree, right? Because he started a new activity, a new action, which was a note on a post-it. Let's see, he was talking on the phone and he stopped to write a note. The second action, action was to write the note on a post-it. Okay, let me see, Susana, number three. Three? Please remember to include, include your names in the application forms. Remember to include, perform an activity. Let's see, yes, remember, remember it means to remember to perform a responsibility or task. Excellent, yeah. Please remember to include your names in the application forms. Thank you. Excellent. Okay, number four, Walter, number four. Uh, the employees will never preparing. Mm -hmm. No, excuse me. Mm -hmm. They never forget to prepare a dinner for those efforts by the headquarters. Okay, help me here, Walter. Uh, repeat. A dinner for those. A dinner for those. Affected. Affected. By the earthquake. By the earthquake. One more time. By. By. The. The. Earthquake. Earthquake. Very good. In esta TH sacó la lengua un poquito, Walter, para que suene a una Z. Earth, earth, earth. Earthquake. Oh, hay una aérea ahí, hay que hacer la zona Earth. 
Earthquake. Quake. Ahí estamos. Earthquake. Earthquake. Better. So, a dinner for those affected by the earthquake. Go. Walter, again, a dinner for those affected by the earthquake. A dinner for those affected. Affected. By, affected. By the by, earthquake. By the earthquake. 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 Better. Okay. So, the employees will never forget to prepare a dinner for those affected by the earthquake. Don't forget something that happened in the past. Don't forget something that happened in the past. To forget, okay, something that happened in the past. This form usually occurs in negative sentences. Mm. Usually occurs on negative sentences. Question, is this a negative sentence? The employees will never forget to prepare, or I'm sorry, the employees will never forget preparing a dinner for those affected by the earthquake. Forget preparing or oh, forget to prepare. Forget for preparing. Me, for mm -hmm. me, it's negative because they mentioned will never. <laughs> I'm sorry, so it is ING, Rosalina, or, or without? Uh, for me, it's preparing. Forget preparing. So, okay, Susana, what yeah. do you think? Forget preparing. Forget preparing, right? Don't forget something that happened in the past. Forget preparing. Okay, forget infinitive. It means to forget to perform a responsibility or task. Don't forget. This, remember, this is an instruction. And this is something that you will never forget. Something that, as in the, in the example, yeah, we'll never forget. Okay. What, which part? ¿Qué parte le confunde? Esta parte, vamos a ver. Si yo pongo forget con un gerundio, es algo que no voy a olvidar, que será memorable para mí. Muchas veces lo vamos a ver exactamente como en los ejemplos, en un futuro inexistente. Eh, si quiero decir, siempre recordaré. We never oh, no. forget. No, sigo ocupando uh, recordar yeah. en lugar de olvidar. Ajá. Nunca olvidaré. Sigo diciendo, oh, nunca Siempre olvidaré. <laughs> ah, but it's the same porque puedo ocupar remember con, con un gerundio. De hecho, aquí está. Pero en este caso, vaya, veamos estos dos casos. O, nunca olvidar algo es muy similar a siempre recordar algo. ¿Sí o no? Es lo mismo, ¿no? The other, other way. It's just another way. Ajá, es solamente otra forma de decirlo. Pero quiero que, uh -huh. que quede claro eso. Impositive. Okay. Impositive. Oh. Uh, yeah, puede ser un impositivo, correcto. No, so, positive. No, impositive. Uh, positive. Positive. It's positive. Positive. Okay. It is positive. Okay. Recordarnos el gerundio. I will always remember. No. Uh -huh. I will always remember dancing with you on the prom. I will never forget dancing with you on the prom. Las dos cosas son algo positivo, correcto. Nunca olvidaré bailar contigo en la promo. Siempre recordaré bailar contigo en la promo. Estoy diciendo exactamente lo mismo. Ok. Ahora, estos dos ejemplos, cuando ocupo el forget con el infinitivo y el remember con el infinitivo, si lo notan es más como una imposición, como una orden. Usualmente, ¿no? Estoy diciendo a alguien que no olvide llevar a cabo tal, eh, tal task, una tarea específica. Llevar a cabo una tarea específica. Please remember to leave the reports. Don't forget to meet us. Don't forget to meet us. Meet us at five. Ok, eh, que espero que haya quedado un, po un poco más claro eso. Y no se preocupen, ahorita vamos a hacer más ejercicios con eso. So let's move on. Exercise number four. Wendy, would you like to try it or help us? 
Number four or five. Four. Wait, no, right? Where, where are we? Where are we? Four or five? Five. Five, okay. Wake up, teacher. Exactly. Thank you, Wendy. <laughs> um, number five, bigger companies show, show try helping, helping smaller companies to increase their own profit. Profits. Profits, sure. Pro Fits. Pro profits. Exactly. Smaller companies to increase their own profits. So this should sound like an experiment. So let's see. What's the verb? Try. Okay. Try, try. There we go. So try plus a gerund. This form is used when something is done as an experiment. Ding, 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 ding. But the result may not be successful. Let's see. Bigger companies should try helping smaller companies to increase their own profits. We don't know the result, but if the intention is to make it sound as an experiment, then yes, bigger companies should try helping smaller companies. Good job, Wendy. Thanks, teacher. And the last one, Adita. Forget. Okay, be. number six. Don't forget to be their own time to recite your award. Don't forget to perform an activity. Good job. That's, that's exactly right. Don't forget, this is an instruction. Let's see, forget an infinitive. It means to forget to perform a responsibility or task. And again, this sounds like um, an order, okay? So don't forget to be, don't forget to be there on time, to receive your award. Ada, receive. Receive. Award. 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 Uh -huh. To receive your award. Una clase super rápida de fonética. Cuando una vocal va seguida de dos consonantes, pierde su sonido natural. ¿Cuál es el sonido natural de la A? Lo que acaba de ser Ada. A, right? A, E, I, O, U. Entonces Adita dijo, ah, entonces una A tendría que sonar a A. Muy bien. A word, a word, a word. Ajá. No, suena, aquí pierde su sonido natural la A. Y suena a O, a word. A word. Lo mismo ocurre con el verbo caminar. How do you say caminar in English? Walk. No. Walk. 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 ¿Y por qué? Es W-A-L-K. Tiene dos consonantes después de la A. Walk. ¿Otro ejemplo? Rapidín. Work. Talk. Talk. Work. Wait, wait. Work. Talk, teacher. Oh, oh. Walk. Oh, oh, wor work, 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 oh, si sí pierde el sonido. Y suena a O específicamente. Talk, talk, work. talk, walk. Warm, work. Word, word. Ah, pero si el sonido natural de la O es O, oh. ajá, uh -huh. word. Porque suena a U, porque hay una W en los ejemplos que me están dando. Word. World. Ok. Good job. Just solo, solo consideren eso. Piensen en eso. Cuando hay una palabra que termina en dos consonantes después de una vocal, la vocal pierde su sonido natural. Ok. So, what's next? The attendance. And then we're going to do an activity so you cannot, so you don't get bored. You're not going to get bored tonight. Where is Susie? Susie, are, could you stay with me 10 minutes? Hold on. I was, I was with Pamela because she was missing. Um, I was with Rosalina before. Yeah. Uh, Susana? We lost her. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay. So let me do the attendance, guys. Uh, Patricia Linares Caldames. Present. Thank you. Adriana Stephanie Martinez Flores. 
Adriana, I think she's there. Ana Selmi Chévez. Present teacher. Thank you. Edwin Alexander Ayala Erazo. Not here tonight. Gabriela Alejandra Gonzalez Flores. Present. Gloria Elizabeth Linares Galdames. Here. Thank you. Carla Verónica Vázquez de Rivas. I'm here, teacher. Bien. Kenia Michelle Lara Sayas. Nelson Edgardo Sánchez Ramírez. Present teacher. Pamela Beatriz Posada Reina. Rosalena Salgado de Serrano. Present teacher. Thank you. Sandra Gladys Méndez Ramírez. Present teacher. Susana Carolina Hernández Iraeta. Okay. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present. Wendy Patricia Molina Duarte. Present. And Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Wilfredo was here. I don't know where he went. Okay, so what's next on our agenda? I'm gonna send, send you right now to your WhatsApp some images of the rules to modify uh, verbs. If you want to add a gerund or an infinitive, it's four images in total. And what are we going to do? Okay. Se la voy a poner medio fácil, okay? Vamos a ocupar de estos listados, como son cuatro, vamos a ocupar ocho verbos. Tratar de incluir dos de cada listado. If you notice, the first list of verbs says common verbs followed by a gerund. Okay, and it starts with ab abhor, acknowledged, admit. You got it? That's the first list. Did you get it? Hold on. So I repeat, first list, common verbs followed by a gerund. That is the first list. Where is this thing? It's not coming up. If I do this, okay, no. Algo está pasando raro con mi Zoom. It's not drawing for some reason. Hold on. There we go. Okay, so two verbs from this list or more if you want, it's okay. Two verbs from this list. Two verbs from this list, common verbs followed by an infinitive, agree. I agree to go. Listen, I agree to go. It appears to me, mm, it appears to be a great idea. Um, I always arrange to stand on the line for, to buy the tickets. So, etc. followed by an infinitive. Next list, two more of this list, verbs followed by a gerund or an infinitive with little to no change in the meaning. Just pick two of them and followed the rules you can either use I start, it started rain, it started raining. There's no difference, right? Can bear, I can bear to see you, I can bear seeing you, okay? Can stand, I can stand you. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can stand drinking alcohol. I can stand drinking alcohol. Wow, este ejemplo está perfecto. I can't stand to drink alcohol, sería no soporto tomar alcohol. I can stand drinking alcohol. No me puedo parar bebiendo alcohol. 
<laughs> so <laughs> it totally changes the meaning range. Okay, that's the third list. And the last list, verse followed by a gerund or infinitive with a change in meaning. Okay, so the ones we saw, forget, go on, quit, regret, remember, stop and try. Questions? ¿Qué vamos a hacer? Bien, alguien que me diga en 10 segundos qué es lo que vamos a hacer. Tratar de hacer dos oraciones de cada, agarrar cada, dos verbos de cada lista. Uh -huh. ¿Y solo hacer oraciones? Eh, utilizando, no, utilizando el erundio. Ah, momento. O, Ajá. Las, las instrucciones que salen en el... <laughs> Correcto. Vaya, en este ejemplo dice common verse followed by a yarn. Tienen que ser con yarn estos. Ahora, ¿será que solo vamos a hacer oraciones, Ana Sermi? Oh, yeah, I'm sorry, teacher. I understand the. Uh -huh. No, I'm sorry. You don't get it? Okay. I don't care. I didn't get it. Repeat. I didn't get I it. I didn't get it, teacher. <laughs> okay. I didn't get it. You got it. Okay. Bien, eh, vamos a crear una historia ocupando dos verbos de cada listado. ¿Ok? What? Yeah, let's do it. So, aquí es donde tienen que trabajar en equipo, en parejas, porque hay varios compañeros que pues eh, se les pide. Mi historia enlazando okay. los seis verbos. Mm, ocho, ajá. Ah, ocho. ¿Sí? O sea, gerundios, infinitive, los que significan dos. Lo que uh -huh. significan eh, Pueden cambiar sus diferentes significados. significados, si es el uh -huh. Ah, son uh -huh. ocho. Okay. Sí, son ocho. Uh -huh. Traten de atar cabos. Hay bastantes verbos ahí. Muchos, algunos verbos que ustedes no ocupan, de hecho. Ni yo no me he dado cuenta que detest. Detest es un verbo. I detest. Nada más he ocupado ese verbo, honestamente. I detest. That, that smell. Yo diría, I, don't I know. hate that smell. I don't know that. That a bore, a bore, a bore. Yeah, a bore. What is it? Is the testar. A bore is to hate yeah. something? Yeah, a bore is to hate testar. Oh. Regard, regard with this ghost, this ghost, um, hat, hat, oh my God, hatred. Uh -huh, it's hatred. like, hatred. it's hatred. like the test. Mm-hmm. So see, that's can the I, point. Go can ahead. I say, can I say I abhor people that speeding? Oh, oh, oh. Uh, I abhor reckless. Reckless? What is reckless? Drivers. Right now. I abhor reckless drivers. Conductores imprudentes. I have more reckless drivers. Uh, that's what the way I will do it. Yeah. I have more reckless drivers. I hate reckless drivers. I don't like, I detest. Okay. Hoy si estamos claros. Bien. Ahora, ¿qué vamos a hacer? Unamos nuestras ideas, las ponemos en escrito y uno de ustedes lo envía al grupo de WhatsApp. Okay. Good. Try to be creative guys try to be I creative i know you can do this so let's split again one more time same groups okay let's do it do it hello pamela Hello, Carlita. Hey. Hi, Sandra. Hello. Good evening. Hello. Uh, okay. okay. We need to choose two verbs. Create a story, right? First, create, yes. create a story. Yes, create a story. Okay. story. Mm. Well, we can With take a logic, one. logic link. Logic link. Logic link. Okay. 
What is like? What do you mean with that? Sorry. The creative story. We need no, to no. choose. Yeah, yeah. No, yeah. No, continue. Sorry. We need to choose two verbs for each list. And we need to yeah. structure the sentence and connection with our story. Okay. Eight, eight verbs. Yes, teacher. Eight. <laughs> <laughs> Create uh, it. We need to to do. Create it. <laughs> yeah, okay. that's it. That's it. The way you said it. Perfect. Okay. Okay. Mm, this is the first list to followed by Gerald. Okay. Mm -hmm. Miss. Okay. Mm. Um, he means uh, playing with his friends. Okay. Um, Could be. Mm, I propose um mm, I know mm. okay and then let me see the bell okay. Uh, for example, now, mm -hmm. now I appreciate um, sharing with my family and bueno, es una historia que la vamos a, a hacer usando estos ocho verbos, ¿verdad? Vamos a seleccionar dos verbos que se usan Normalmente, eh, posterior un gerundio, posterior un infinitive, los que tienen significado diferente, dependiendo si son gerundios o infinitive, uh -huh. y esos ocho verbos hacerle una historia. Bye. Mm. Primero creemos la historia, ¿de qué sería uh -huh. la historia? Ajá, pero, pero yo creo que hay que ir apuntando porque cuando si la creamos... No, no, no. Ya no. es, es Carlita. Ok. Si no, cuando terminamos ya, nos, ya se nos ha olvidado el principio. No, totalmente de acuerdo. It's, it's Friday, teacher. It's Friday. Ok. Yeah, long week. Yeah, it's been a long uh, week. Okay, we'll see. Hi, teacher. I can stay. I can. I can stay in the in the end of class. Okay. At the end of the class. Good. Good. Thank you. Yes. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, Yada. When the first we can use. Mm, Participate change and the list and the report. Miss, we can say, um, ah, Miss, Ada Miss goes his country, maybe, Ada? Yes. Uh -huh. And she don't forget she the picture. Or the lamar for me. Yeah. 
I am right. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> Adam is her city. She doesn't forget of a picture. We can use picture. Okay. Uh, How do you see it? Adam is her city. She doesn't forget because of her picture. Maybe? Eh, eh, okay. Okay. Excuse me. In the second. Um, Okay. Mm -hmm. And then we see other payables. Mm -hmm. Boss. Boss to go. To go. But the ways I can we can use to quit if she didn't get the rings at all. Only to visit his friends. Ada Paya was to go early to visit his friends, maybe? The second other? Yes. Okay, the third. She's in the Is continued with the tradition his grandma? No, I don't need to If you use continued, um, I um, I already lost myself. Um, uh, I read the history in group, but for the continue, for me continue, read 
Oui, please. Okay. I send in the chat for you to read. Let me yes. see. Some, Where else some son of my friends son of my friends were missing. Oh. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. I got to be celebrating. Yes, celebrate. I was Ce celebrating. Celebrating, yeah. My birthday, we, some uh -huh. friends. No, were... my birthday. Okay, okay. Yesterday, I was celebrating my birthday. Yes. But, but some of my friends were missing. Yeah. But some of my friends were missing. Okay. Okay, in that case, we use celebrate and miss, like the birds, and we convert to ing. Yes. Okay, we continue with the next page. We need two birds plus the infinitive. If we can, if we can continue the history, okay. We're going to say, um, okay. Let me. Okay, maybe maybe we can use ask the bird ask and use with an infinitive and we can say I make a phone call to ask them what happened. Yeah. Hello, teacher. <laughs> it's a difficult. I make it. I make no, it. no. I make. I make. I make. Excuse me, excuse me. Yeah, I make a phone call. A phone call. Call a phone call. To ask them. To ask. Ask to ask. To ask, to ask them, them what happened. What happened? The use of the verb is a. Uh, we use ask like a verb. Yes. Yes. At, yes. And with two, we made the infinitive. Okay. Yes. I don't know, it's okay, but Ask. Okay, let me what happened. We need another verb to use with the infinity. 
because are true. Suba un poco la, 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 la página, Nelson. Nelson, please. What do you think? What do you think? Bájelo un poquito. No, 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 perdón, suba. Que se vea, que se vea completa. Vaya, ya, ya. What other, what other verb, verb we can use? What happened? What happened? Why? Uh, but the, the, this pay uh, to use to burn. Yeah, we use yeah. ask the first one. Uh -huh. And the second? In, in the next pay, in the other pair. No, sería de allí mismo. no we no. need two. Tenemos que usar yeah. dos de allí. Tenemos que usar yeah. dos de allí. We need to choose another because yes. only. It's in the use as uh -huh. ask is the one the first one uh -huh. yeah. the second one okay we mm, need a second that's one happened. that's what happened mm -hmm. uh -huh. Uh -huh. what do you think about that Ajá, ayer celebré mi cumpleaños, pero mis amigos, algunos de mis amigos no vinieron. Ajá. O los no sé. extrañé, no sé cómo podríamos traducirlo. Hice, hice una llamada, Ajá. o sea, les llamé por teléfono para preguntarles qué sucedió. O, ah, ¿qué, ¿Qué pasó? ¿Qué pasó? Ajá. Ajá. Vale, ¿Qué puedo verbo? seguir diciendo? Ajá. Ajá, pero busquemos un verbo de lo que está Ajá. aquí que nos... Que continue. Ajá, continue. Que de... continue.
Comentarme, ¿qué más? Listo. Sí. Ellos fueron a aprender. Pasado un periodo de tiempo antes de esto. Continúa. Sorry, what is the next one? Uh, the birth with she, the, she, the birth. with by an, an infinity. I'm sorry, Pamela. What is the next one that we need to do? A uh, infinity birth uh, followed by an infinity. Is the last is the depending gerund or infinitive change the meaning. Ah, okay. Depend of the use the gerund or, or infinity. Uh -huh. I forgot to change the meaning. Mm. Oh, when all gone, they the gone, <laughs> gone. Hmm. Let me do it first. Go home. Pero nos falta el del, el del verbo seguido por un gerundio o un infinity. Uh -huh. Como un ¿Se puede que le pregunte? Uh, de, cambio en la oración. En el ah, ok. ¿Verdad? Esa Follow nos falta para completar las ocho. Ok. The verse following by the general, general, general our infinity with little dot to change in uh -huh. meaning. Okay. Esa no las pasamos. It's a starter to rain. It's a starter rain. I prefer. They prefer. Uh -huh. They prefer. To share together. It's right. They prefer. To share together. To share together, yeah. Ellos. Onion and garlic. They prefer to share together. They prefer to share they prefer together. They prefer to share. We need to put the, the bow, right? Sorry, Pamela. We need to put the bow because they prefer to... Mm -hmm. To share together, they prefer to sharing together. Mm. They, sorry, to they prefer sharing together. 
That sounds better. Yeah, they prefer mm -hmm. sharing together or they prefer to share together. I think that's yes. Compartir. Yeah. And infinity, what it means here? Yeah. Oh. They hate. Es lo que no le no le gusta a, a, a onions y a Carly. Mm -hmm. Parte de aparte de las visitas. Las medicinas. Oh, las medicinas. Ah, oh, ok. Ellos prefieren compartir juntos. They hate. They y las medicinas se toman. Drink, teacher. Eating, right. Swallow. ¿Cómo se dice? Swallow. Swallow. Yeah. How do este what they mean? Swallow. You drink liquids, Poco but profundo. You... No, no, no. You drink liquids, but you swallow food. Swallow. You got it? You drink liquids, but you swallow food. Swallow. Swallow. Es así como medio tragadito. That's the meaning. Es tragar. Oh. A, tragar agua o tragar comida yeah. or medicine yeah hard objects I mean siempre recuerda visitar el veterinario Pero como que falta más fluidez así para la historia. Sure. As long as it makes sense. No, oh, we need to, to create only one sentence more. One more sentence. One more sentence. One more sentence, yeah. Um, the other girls. Okay. Mm, remember, stop. But stop with parar esta actividad. Puede ser tener un golpe. Así de repente. O interrumpir otra acción. Stop to call him. Me detuve para hablar. Nos falta una. Sí, nos falta una. De sí, seguido, ya sea de gerundio o infinity, pero que tengan un cambio en su significado. Uh -huh. Bueno, ahorita acabamos de poner uno que es uh, Always remember to visit Remember Pero aquí es Carla, ¿verdad? Carla siempre Carla siempre recuerda visitar al veterinario Y, y será así and she don't stop to demonstrate um, okay we read hi teacher we finish can you hear good Good, yes. Okay. Please send it to the WhatsApp group. Okay, okay. You send Gabby, please? You send him? Yes. Uh, okay. Give me a minute. Okay. Um, okay, okay. 
we change some words. Good, good. Let me see the last group to see if they are done okay. already. Thank you. Okay. Are you missing any verbs? No, teacher. You're done? I almost, I think. Okay, no. I'll wait for you and then send the story to the WhatsApp group. Okay. Um, okay, Nelson, can you can you let share the, the verse? I can I can I, I want to I want to share the, the history. Nelson. Walter, you write. Nelson, can, can, puedes dejar de compartir. Quiero enseñarla. Quiero enseñar lo okay. que tengo. Ok. It's a little bit. Okay. Okay. If we are going to talk the first, the first one. Okay. Yesterday, I was celebrating. Here's the first letter to celebrate. We are using with ING. I was celebrating my birthday, but some of my friends were missing. missing. Here's the second, mm -hmm. miss with missing. I make a phone call. Oh, mm -hmm. oh yes, okay. to ask, mm -hmm. it's not, it's not ask to, <laughs> to ask, yeah, yeah. Okay, to ask because we use ask to ask them what happened. Ask After that, them. I tell them, I would like to, I would like to, I would like to, they've been there because it was a special night. And at the end, the last, the last part we use, uh, which one of the on this bear because it's been the same i chose i propose them to celebrate again and have a good time together i choose propose with uh, an infinity in this case is celebrate i propose them to celebrate we can say i propose them celebrating Again, because I understand that it's meant the, the same. It's correct, teacher. No. <laughs> Sorry, I propose them to celebrate again. I propose them celebrating again. Yeah, it's the same and have a good time together. So difficult. I hate it's making not, histories. Is, I hate doing histories. Yeah, creating. I hate, I hate creating, yeah, creating stories. I Come on, just send it. No. I'll, I'll wait for you. <laughs> Are you ready? Yes. Okay, <laughs> let's go back because we have to check the grammar on this. So send okay. it back. Okay. I'm, my hair is turning silver. I don't like that. But anyways, let's wait for the order. Is okay. Oh come on! Can you copy and paste the, the text? 
on WhatsApp? Could you? Could you copy and paste the text on WhatsApp? Me, teacher? Yep. Please. <gasps> okay, I'm going to try. Okay. So I'm going to start with uh, Susana's group, Gabby. Okay. Let me see. How do we do this? I need to see you as well. So here you are. Okay. So let's make this bigger. Okay. So this is what we're going to do right now. I need okay. your, I need everybody's help right now. Let's okay. go sentence, okay. sentence by sentence. Ada misses going her city. Are we missing anything? We use misses and going. Good, good. Are we missing anything on this sentence, everybody? Bien, aquí necesito que todos... Si no tienen ruido a su alrededor, enciendan su micrófono y me vayan diciendo, ok, teacher, falta tal cosa. So, Ada misses going her city. Ada misses going to her city. Going to her city. Excellent. Going to her city. Going to. Because she enjoy to stay with her family. Esa sería la segunda razón. Second sentence, because she enjoyed to stay with her family. Mm -hmm. Enjoys. Excellent. Third person, right? Mm -hmm. Because she enjoys. Now here, is it okay if I say to stay or staying with her family because she enjoys staying with her family she enjoys to stay with her family enjoy staying maybe staying we don't use to que dice el público she enjoys staying with her family. enjoy verse followed by a gerund list number one so yes she enjoys staying Mm -hmm. with her family good period okay Ada paid hmm. Hmm. no no it's okay okay <laughs> Ada paid the bus to go early to visit his friends everybody what can we correct on this next sentence Maybe going. Going. Maybe. Take Maybe bus going. to going. Mm -hmm. No, no. Going. Take bus to going. Teacher. Only for mm -hmm. visitors, maybe? Mm -hmm. Before visited. For example, can you retell it? Either pay the bus to go early. Or, or either buy the ticket. Change the verb, okay. I'm actually wondering if the past pay, pay, pay is paid. Pay is not paid. But going? The verb paid is P A. <laughs> it's not buyer. <laughs> exactly. Me, that, that, yeah, that's the, yeah, that's okay. American. Uh -huh. This the is, verse, me, no, look. It sounds like paid, but it's not yeah. right in that way. <laughs> it's irregular verb. It's an irregular verb, but. Oh, I don't want to confuse you. Uh, English people, Britain, Britain, British English, in British English, they are so lazy sometimes, they just add the ED or the opposite. So let's move on. So Ada paid the bus 
to go early. Okay. This action happened in the past, right? She paid the bus. For to go visit. early to visit to visit his friends. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Ada paid the bus to go early to visit her. Wait. Her friends. So they are, right? Good. Her friends. Yes. Yes. She planning make a dinner. She's planning. She is planning. Let's see. Adam is going to her city because she enjoys staying with her family. Ada paid the bus to go early to visit her friends. She's planning. Yeah, we can use present yeah. continuous. She's planning make a dinner. Hmm. Planning. The hmm. dinner. Huh? The dinner. Wait, plan, 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 plan is on the first mm -hmm. list. Okay, mm -hmm. let's go to the second one, the second list, letter P, planning P, plan. W -N. Plan, after planning, you need to use two, okay? Plan, so that's the second list. She is planning to make... E-W-N, teacher, the planning. Mm -hmm. Consonant, vowel, consonant, double N, planning. Mm, planning, okay. yeah. Uh -huh. To make a dinner. <laughs> she's planning yeah, to make, she's planning to dinner. prepare. What about make dinner? To en este caso, cook. si yo pongo... To prepare a dinner? Puedo to decir to prepare, cook? puedo decir cook, pero el punto es... Ah, dinner. To prepare a dinner. Uh -huh. Una a cena, a dinner. es decir... A meal. Es una cena... Única, ok. Ella está planeando hacer la cena. ¿Ya? Yeah? Hacer la cena, make dinner. Hacer la cena, hacer una cena, la cena. Ok. okay. Es el, el punto es, el artículo le da como mucha importancia, tengan cuidado con eso. Ok. She's continued with two traditions, his grand and prefer cooking for all. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Everybody. She's continuing. Traditions. Continue. With, with tradition. Traditions. Traditions. She's continuing with tradition. We don't replace, use to replace. Him. We she, continues. Yeah. Exactly. she continues. She continues. With tradition. Okay, she continues. Oh, she continue. En este caso, como es, como es una narrativa de lo que, de una costumbre arraigada a ella, sería, ella continúa. She, continua. she mm -hmm. continues. Uh -huh. Continues. With traditions. Traditions, not with her traditions. Mm -hmm. Okay. With her traditions. Here. Okay. Grand, 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 traditions. grand, grand, traditions. grand, 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 Cooking. What's the subject? And she prefers. Uh -huh. And prefers cooking for all. Again, she for continues all. with her grandma's traditions and prefers cooking for all. Good. And last one. Other tried all. Other tried all ingredients mm -hmm. to remember the his grandma recipe. I try, I try Remember is, is, is bad. It's misspelled, okay. Remember is misspelled. Remember. Uh -huh. I try, I try. Uh 
try. To hear grandma and then hear grandma. Okay. Ada try to remember. Ada try all ingredients to remember the his grandma recipe. Help me. What is wrong here? Her grandma. Okay. Ada try all ingredients to remember the her grandma recipe. 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 Mm -hmm. Her grandma's grandma's grandma. Grandma's. Uh huh. Because it's possible. And next, remember that we need that. Uh -huh. We don't need that. Okay. Ahora, eso ocurre porque estoy traduciendo textual del español al inglés. Las me. recetas de su. Okay. Ada tried all ingredients to remember her grandma's recipe. Ada tried all ingredients to remember her grandma's recipe. Exactly. Good. Recomendación de nuevo, vean este video de nuevo, vean lo que habían escrito y lo comparan con la corrección. You can send this in the chat, teacher. Right away. Okay, thank you. There you go. Okay, really quick. Only two, teacher. What about the others? Okay, what about the, <laughs> the other group? There, there were yeah. three, three groups, right? How many groups we did three. we have? We had no, three. No, but we One. only... We only have two. No, we were. Ada, yeah, I know, Ada, I know. I uh, the other team, the other team, please make sure you send it, okay? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Yesterday. <not> fair, <laughs> I know. I know. <laughs> Let's see. Help me a little bit here. Yesterday, I was celebrating my birthday, but some of my friends were missing. Hmm. I make a phone call to ask them what happened. Any uh, areas of improvement here? What is wrong? The verb ask. What's wrong with it? The past. Mm, like that? Okay. Ask, ask, <laughs> ask. <laughs> yeah, no, <laughs> I don't know. Estoy esperando que alguien más me ayude aquí. ¿Qué onda? Porque esto me está ayudando a, a identificar I, áreas de I oportunidad made, en la mayoría. I made a phone. Exactly. I made a phone call. Call. Nelson, Sandra, Glorita, Ada, where are you ask. guys? Okay. I made a okay, phone call happened? to ask. 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 Bien. Súper rápido. Then what happened? Este verbo domina a los demás y oí yo hice una llamada para preguntar en español sigo diciendo que el verbo hice domina a los demás y ya los demás vienen en presente simple incluso en el español so I made a phone call to ask them y ahora sí what happened y sigo en el español con la misma qué pasó En cambio, si digo, ¿qué pasa? Sería en español acá. Wow. Ojo, en el presente, perdón. Ok, so I made a phone call to ask them what happened. Ahora, um, ¿qué había pasado? ¿Qué pasó? Depende de cómo I expresar. Need, I need, ¿Mm? uh, sí, sí. What sign? No necesita sí, no hay, ¿qué pasó? A, 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 a phone, oh, oh, what happened? To ask them what happened. Mark? No, because you're mm -hmm. not narrating. Okay. You're just narrating. Yeah, it, it's not to ask them what happened. It's different. Like this, Susana. To ask them what happened. That's different. But if I'm just narrating, I don't need the punctuation. Very good. Very good. The, ex the exclamation points. Okay, so what happened? Period. After that... I tell them. I told them. Excellent. Good. Nelson, how to do? I told them. I told them I would like to they being there because it was a special night. And I, I okay, I told them I will like. Okay, I will like. I had. I had 
me, me hubiera gustado. I have, I could like. Me gustaría que ellos estuvieran. Like that. I told them yeah. I would like them to be in there or I would like them to be. What is, what is followed by like? What goes after like? Mm -hmm. oh. uh, I, ING also? or infinitive? infinitive? Like, infinitive? I say, yeah. Yeah, would like, yeah. Followed by an infinitive. I don't in believe you. List. I don't trust you. <laughs> yeah, in the list that you said, it's a pair of like. <laughs> yeah, like an gerund infinitive. or infinitive? Both. Okay. Infinite. So, uh, both. <laughs> I, uh, I would like them to be there because it was a special <laughs> night. Okay. Hmm. I would like them to be there. Okay. I propose them to celebrate again and have a good time together. You got it. You got it. You, oh, 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 oh. you <clears throat> nailed it. You nailed it. Okay. What's the meaning of you nailed it? What is that? What uh -huh. does it mean? You rock. You rock. What's the meaning? Lo lograste. You made it. It's another way of saying you made it. Pero lo hiciste como un campeón. So you nailed it. Man, you're you're a pro. You're amazing. You nailed it, man. You nailed it. Nailed. Nailed it. Okay. So it's 10 o'clock. We have to go. I'll see you on Monday. Please practice. And the missing groups, please send your. Vamos a hacer algo para el fin de semana. Que los que faltaron, que envíen su historia al WhatsApp y los demás nos criticamos así con todo. You're mean, <laughs> you're mean, <laughs> Rosalina. <laughs> Revenge. <laughs> Come on. Okay, see you on Monday, okay? Uh, Patricia Linares Galdames. Present. Thank you. Adrián Estefani Martínez Flores. Ana Selmi Chévez. Present teacher. Edwin Alexander Ayala Erazo. Gabriela Alejandra González Flores. Present. Good night. Good night. Gloria Elizabeth Linares Galdames. Carla Verónica Vázquez de Rivas. And good night. Good night. Kenya Michelle Arasayas. She was not here tonight. Nelson Edgardo Sánchez Ramírez. Present. Good night, teacher. Good night. Pamela Beatriz Posada Reina. Good evening, President. Roselena Salgado de Serrano. Present, teacher. Sandra Gladys Méndez Ramírez. Present, teacher. Susana Carolina Hernández Iraeta. Present. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present. Good night. Good night. Wendy Patricia Molina Duarte. And Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Good night, guys. Enjoy your weekend. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Good night. See you Monday. Happy See weekend. You. See you Monday. Bye bye. <laughs>
Yeah, I have to do many follow-ups. I have to do yes. many follow-ups every day yes. of multiple projects. Okay. Yes. Are you on the field or in the office? In the office. In the office. So yes. you, you spend all day sitting? Yes. Uh, okay. I yes. know. I know how you feel. <laughs> yes, it, it's a, I, I feel tired. It's only that. It's, it's just extenuating. It's not getting tired. You get extenuated. Your brain is, is too busy all day. Yes. Yes, because I am I am talking people. Talking to? Uh, talking to people. And I am how do you say como que lo andas siguiendo? Para que te den la info. Following people. Okay, following people. Yes. To to get results, to get information. Yes. Okay, yes. Wow. How long have you been working there? Um in March I have 15 years. I will have 15 years. Yes, in March. 15. 15 years. Wow. Yes. Wow. Uh, so you are some sort of supervisor? Yes. Okay. Do you get upset? No entendí. Do you get upset? Uh, sometimes. 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 Sometimes Hulk comes outside. Give me the work. Uh, no? I have I have difficulties with some people, but it's <laughs> a little. It's a, a few yeah, my point is that my point is that I was reading, you know, that if you get stressed, too too much stress is dangerous for your health. Yes, yes. So, uh, nowadays, these companies, these call centers, they have some sort of um, they don't complicate their lives. That's what I'm trying to tell <laughs> you. Everything is written. If you miss a date, let's say in your case, let's say, um, let's say Fulanito missed a date. He knows that the penalty is one amonestation, right? One mm -hmm. la labor action, okay? Number one, next month, he missed the date again. Second verbal warning. Hmm. Next that month. That is different. Mm -hmm. I mean, it, you can do that. You, you could do that, you know, and you don't complicate your life. Because, of course, the boss or someone above you tells them, okay, from now on, this is, a, there, this is a warning process. On the fifth warning, not on the third warning, but on the fifth warning. Yes, but in my, in my company, you can make a warning because they don't give you the information or they give you some you ask. I can do that. Only wait, only push, push, and wait. Okay, so they they mm -hmm. end up they end up doing it because you push. Yes. But why do you need to? Push? It's not good. It's not good. Yes, it's not my job. It's push, push. But if I don't, if I don't do that, they don't I, give I, me nothing. And in the end, I have a problems because I don't have a, the project. That's the point. That's mm -hmm. the point. Is efficiency, efficiency, and if you force someone all the time, the same way, the person gets used to it, and eventually they go like, "Vienen las Susana otra vez, ya va a venir, quiero ver, son las tres y siete, ya va a venir hoy es miércoles, es que tiene que venir a pedirme la información y no se la tengo y le voy a decir que no la puedo dar mañana, le voy a decir que venga a las dos." So they, they are something like that, something like that. I, I was on your shoes. It, dealing with people is the most difficult thing. Yes. But, but I learned, I learned that if you become, I don't know how to say that word and is a bad word in Spanish, but you know, if you don't care, you act like you don't care. Okay, sorry, there's a disciplinary action for this. Okay, here's here it is. Please, can you sign this? Okay, sign this. I didn't do it. Okay, and I will do it tomorrow at 10 a.m. Okay, good job. Thank you. 
Yes, I report with with emails and following, but it's the same. I think the people is very comfy. They are comfy. They are they are in the comfort zone. It's a uh, comfort yes. zone. And, and are they tied to the administrative law? Están amarrados a la ley administrativa. Yes, yes, because many works is like we need a complement to to DNA. You listened? Mm -hmm, yes. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. We we work on many required requirements. Mm -hmm. Requirements. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's difficult. But again, yes, because the people the people say his work. The people say it's working, working, and I do with with sometimes is like extra for day mm -hmm. you end up doing a lot of extra work that you shouldn't have to do that's the difficult part is it a governmental institution or is it no, private? No. Is, it's it's private. a private yes oh my god we make wow. medicine okay it's a lot. Mm -hmm. okay it's a lot. Mm -hmm. oh god well be patient Yes. Okay, because your health is very important. Don't forget that. Okay, and if you get stressed, um, bueno, en español, mi esposa me envió en el 2004 cuando éramos novios todavía. Jamás se me olvidó que me envió una presentación cuando estaban de moda las presentaciones así. De... Ah, sí, sí, de PowerPoint. The PowerPoint. Sí. Jamás se me olvida que me envió algo así y hablaba de que todos necesitamos un amante. Así. Ah, sí, lo escribió Paulo Coelho. Ajá. De Paulo Coelho. De Paulo Coelho, sí. después me enteré, correcto. Y era eso, sí. tocar la guitarra, sí. algo que te desestrese. Un libro, cabal, algo, sí, algo que te, que te quite la, un, algo que te llame la atención. Un ¿sí? té, un café en la, en la, si tiene, ¿cómo se llama esta cosa? A terraza, o algún lugar. Y cantar. En especial, cantar, lo que sea. Cantar, cuando uno viene, es algo, like, I mean, driving. Oh, the traffic. my friends, yes. Exactly. So, try, try to find it. Try. Tenía una amiga que decía que su hobby era molestar al esposo. Cuando se estresaba <laughs> mucho. Eso es bueno. Eso es bueno. <laughs> Está bien. Ok, eso sí, pero please take care, ok? Thank you. I'll see thank you on you. Monday. I'm Good sorry night. for sleeping. Ah, oh, no, don't worry. I understand. Okay, thank you. Good night. See you. Bye. See you.